Hey guys. Welcome to today's video. In this channel we are discussing about the top 10 lists. I post daily content from now. Please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell because you don't want to miss any of my videos. If you like my videos press the like button. That would mean a lot. Comment down below what top 10 list should I do next. And today's video is about. Top 10 fastest cars in the world in 2020. There is no such benchmark for automotive success as the world's fastest cars to build or drive. It's a brand manufacturers are already competing for for decades. As cars became sleeker and lighter and faster, the records inched their way upwards. The recipe for the world's quickest race car is an enigmatic one. Historic automotive makers, pedigree, are currently optimizing production vehicles to be even quicker, eking out peak speeds that are only miles per hour quicker than their rivals. Fascinating findings have arisen from delving into the brands and styles that are racing towards that landmark. Not only are automotive makers using the finest materials and the most meticulous tests and procedures, but with every modified manufacturing vehicle, they are now collaborating with the aerospace industry and innovating new engines. In addition to being a work of art, this makes every hypercar and supercar a cutting-edge example of scientific serendipity in action. In a few examples, we found that the world's fastest cars were also the most expensive, both the Aston Martin Valkyrie and Bugatti's Le Voiture Noir, for instance, managed to enter both of our recent lists. Number 10. Tesla Roadster. This Tesla electric four-seater concept, arriving in 2020, is rumored to be capable of accelerating in 1.9 seconds from 0 to 100 km per hour, 0 to 60 miles per hour. If proven, this acceleration would make the Roadster the street legal car with the fastest acceleration to date. Tesla is now a household name in the auto industry as an established maker of top-tier electric vehicles. If it can also produce a bona fide supercar, the Tesla name would certainly be improved. The 2020 redesign, as the replacement of the 2008 Tesla Roadster, will be a coupe with a removable glass top. Three electric motors allow all-wheel drive and a strong feeling that you can feel no matter where you're seated in the car, one in the front, two in the back. 400 km per hour, 250 miles per hour, is the maximum speed officially attained by the prototype. Number 9. McLaren Speedtail. The McLaren Speedtail is the fourth edition, following the Senna, to the McLaren Ultimate series. It is a limited production sports car which debuted in February of 2020, and it is already making the rounds as an extremely fast electric car, which actually recharges while it's driving. The Speedtail is engineered to trickle charge at any stage where the car is not taxed to its potential, with a wireless charging pad that is integrated into the car itself. It's not our only futuristic possession. At the click of a bell, the glass making up the windshield and roof of the vehicle is electrochromic and will darken. On sunny days, you'll no longer need sunglasses if you're pulling a speedtail. Instead of using inset cameras to track blind spots, since this car has no mirrors, the speedtail is not road legal. However, since its peak speed is a towering 402.3 km per hour, 250 miles per hour, it will be impossible to locate a regular path to test it, anyway. In 12.8 seconds, the McLaren Speedtail will accelerate from 0 to 299 km per hour, 0 to 186 miles per hour. They have not yet issued an official number of 0 to 100 km, 0 to 60 miles per hour. Number 8. Rimac Concept 2. Rimac's design 2 is semi-autonomous, all-electric and described as a major technological leap. A car alive with technology with face recognition, it can be unlocked, and it is capable of automated driver assistance. Butterfly doors and a fire extinguisher, held by a leather strap, are built into the arrangement. This car is branded as a hard-to-drive electric car, and many of its specifications are written to add credence to the assertion. Until recharging is required, the Concept 2 has a maximum range of 647 km (402 miles). This is roughly the range required without brakes or a performance lapse to run two laps of the Nürburgring. The Rimac Concept 2 is now one of the most awaited vehicles in 2020, with a cumulative production of 150 vehicles, sold out status and a long wait list. This year, deliveries are expected to take place. The Rimac Design 2 is able to accelerate in 1.85 seconds to 100 km per hour, 60 miles per hour, and has a maximum speed of 415 km per hour, 258 miles per hour. Number 7. Bugatti Le Voiture Noir. The Black Car Le Voiture Noir. 
Bugatti knew it would be an immediate symbol for their 2019 supercar, so they gave it a clear name and a beautiful, sleek silhouette. Le Voiture Noir is precision engineered for strength and speed, designed as a tribute to Jean Bugatti's beloved World War II Type 57 South Carolina Atlantic. 1,500 horsepower, a fabricated body of carbon fiber, a quad turbo engine and the heft of the Bugatti pedigree. Le Voiture Noir is a ready-to-move and fast-moving piece of art. Le Voiture Noir tops out at a claimed 420 km per hour, 260 miles per hour, from 0 to 100 kph, 0 to 60 miles per hour, in 2.4 seconds. Le Voiture Noir was the most pricey vehicle ever to be sold when it launched in 2019. Number 6. Koenigsegg Ajera RS. The ultimate track tool that's the name given to its Ajera RS by Koenigsegg. It is designed to do well in a race because it features track-optimized technology, as well as a feather-light frame. With minimal drag, it can whip through curves and is so light that it looks like it travels to the thinking, rather than the touch. There were only 25 units sold, and each one was totally personalized by its owner. Both of these Ajera RS divisions, with names like the Ajera RS Griffin and the Ajera RS Draken, have become popular in their own right. The Ajera RS was named the world's fastest production car in 2017. In 2018, it left the global stage to make way for the Jesco, but not before two final edition cars were unveiled. The Ajera Fay Thor and the Ajera Fay Vader. In three seconds, the Ajera RS will accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour, 0 to 60 miles per hour. It has a maximum speed of 284.55 miles per hour, 457 km per hour. Number 5. SSC Tuatara. The long-awaited counterpart to the SSC Ultimate Aero will begin being delivered this year. This car is supposed to be stunning and filled with the latest in automotive technologies as the newest inspiration by an ex-Ferrari builder in concert with SSC North America. It is named after a reptile with the fast-paced development of any living animal. It has drawn a lot of inspiration from the aerospace industry's missiles and swift planes for its internal mechanisms. This vehicle aims to beat its rivals by more than a mile or two, with low drag coefficients, an aerodynamic carbon fiber build, and a lightweight, yet spacious interior with minimal styling. Its maximum speed is said to be 482 km per hour, 300 miles per hour, bringing it 25 km per hour, 15 miles per hour, over the Koenigsegg Ajera. Because it uses a camera system instead of mirrors, it is not expected that this car will be road legal. Production will be restricted to just 100 units. In 2.5 seconds, the SSC Tuatara will accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour, 0 to 60 miles per hour. Number 4. Hennessy Venom F5. The Hennessy Venom F5 is the very first all-new patented car that can be lauded by Hennessy as a certified maker. Perhaps they picked an awe-inspiring name for this reason. F5 is a reference to the fastest tornado type, which reaches similar speeds as it is claimed to be able to hit this vehicle. The Venom F5 produces 1,817 horsepower for use with a bespoke twin-turbocharged engine. It is estimated that it can achieve a maximum speed of 301 miles per hour, 484 kilometers per hour. Although official 0 to 100, 0 to 60 figures have not yet been published by the manufacturer, Hennessy has noted that the Venom F5 can accelerate in under 10 seconds from 0 to 300 km per hour, 0 to 186 miles per hour. This car would cater to a wide range of buyers with a semi-automatic transmission or manual transmission on sale. The Venom F5 uses a carbon fiber frame and body, giving it a streamlined aerodynamic appearance. Number 3. Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus. The Super Sport 300 Plus has an upgraded, more powerful engine, with the same gorgeous side spiral that makes the whole Chiron line iconic. This means that it has the same charm that makes a Bugatti a Bugatti, but it has improved the top speed relative to previous ones. This car also has an exterior look reminiscent of the Varen Super Sport, the other high speed record breaking vehicle of the Bugatti. For lightweight toughness, the Chiron Super Sport features an all-carbon fiber body. A quad-turbocharged W16, which has received the fond nickname Thor for its lightning-quick speeds, can be found inside. In 2.4 seconds, the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus will accelerate from 0 to 100 km an hour, 0 to 60 miles per hour. As far as the peak speed goes, a Bugatti test driver was able to reach a speed under regulated conditions of 490.48 km per hour, 304.77 mph, in 2019. 
Number 2. Koenigsegg Jesko Absolute. The father of the founder of the Swedish producer of cars was Jesko von Koenigsegg. The very latest in their supercar series is named after him. Aerodynamics, downforce, and correct handling are the subject of the Jesko Absolute. This latest vehicle is slated to break previous top speed records absolutely out of the water, with a subtly revised engine from the Ajera RS to give the Jesko Absolute a greater redline. To differ slightly from other Koenigsegg versions, the interior of the cabin has also been reworked. In order to convey crucial information when cruising, drivers can enjoy more leg and headroom, as well as a robust climate control system, a 9.0-inch infotainment panel, and LCD displays in the steering wheel itself. Incredible strength arrives along with these facilities. Although acceleration details including 0 to 100 or 0 to 60 figures has not yet been published by Koenigsegg, it is rumored that this car's prototypes and simulations will top 531 km per hour, 330 miles per hour. What's more, it achieves the rate despite maintaining the world's fastest street legal vehicle. Number 1. Devil 16. The Devil 16 boasts unheard of horsepower, 5007 and a wait time that drives the car industry mad, the project debuted in 2013 and is able to absolutely break the existing world records for top speed. If much of the car industry expects to smash the barrier of 482 km per hour, 300 miles per hour, the Devil 16 strives to smash 560 km, 350 miles per hour, per hour. The lead time left some fans worrying if the Devil 16 is genuine or if it's ever going to come out. The Devil 16 was expected to meet production requirements in late 2019, according to the most current reports we could find. If it is the case, as 2020 starts to go forward, we will be hearing a lot more about it. Literally, the Devil 16 is actually slated to be the world's fastest vehicle. Although the precise details of the Devil 16 are little known, we can't exactly equate the acceleration numbers to the others on our list. The car, however, has impressive horsepower and a top speed capacity of 560 kph, 350 miles per hour, rumored. If this turns out to be real, inside the supercar industry, this will really be the hypercar that sets the stage for the next few years. So guys that's it for today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Press like if you enjoy the video. And comment down below what list should I do in the next video. Okay, bye. Peace out.